easy kill. He's a beast in one v one. Let me be honest. You're dead. Oh my god, mate. Oh, that was insane. Welcome, mate, on Bloodthirsty Lord, but you can come in Lordy and tell we're back on Gigantic for another gameplay. This is going to be insane. But before we get to this video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe button to keep up to date with the greatest and latest Gigantic gaming content and maybe even gaming news for this game as well very soon. If you haven't turned on notifications yet, you can do so by hitting that little bell button next to the subscribe button so you have the chance to become one of the first mates on the channel up to date with my amazing gaming content. As always, expect it here first. So without further ado, let's get straight into this. So we're going to play Gigantic. I want to play his trip. Oh, come on, mate. She's off free rotation. Oh, this sucks. Do we have enough coins? I think we might have enough coins. Because this time needed to happen. Yes, we've got 8,000 plus coins. Easy, easy peasy. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, my God, guys. So many crazy stuff is going to happen with this hero. So let's jump into the gameplay as quick as possible. Now we have that cursed child that wants to play a hero with those arms just coming out of nowhere doing 150 DPS per second. You know which one it is? That one right there. <laughs> oh my god, mates. It's taking quite a bit to get into the match. It might be around 10 minutes by now, but we'll see what happens. Welcome back, mates. I'm Bloodthirsty Lord, but you can call me Lordy, and now we're playing Gigantic on this map. Siren Strand, I think it's what it's called. With this hero, Trip, the one hero that I've always wanted, the one that goes invisible, that does so much damage, it's insane. And this hero is interesting because he reminds me of so many other heroes from other games that I do enjoy. Like within Paragon, Kalari. In League of Legends, um, what's that hero? Shaco. Followed by Heroes of Storm, Zero Tool. It just reminds me of so many heroes that I do enjoy. And bringing the idea of invisibility within the hero is an amazing concept. So, obviously, we need to go ham within this gameplay when we're playing this hero that we just unlock. Trip. I'm hoping it ends up being one amazing gameplay. I'm not really interested in the skill tree because I don't really know too much about it. But I feel like I already went the wrong one because I wanted to go crit damage. But hey, this will be interesting no matter what. So she does have quite a bit of abilities. One of her abilities, obviously, is her basic attacks. Three hit combo, as you can see right now. Followed by this ability here, which is something dance. Oh, no, it's not dance. It's something else. That's electric slide, I think. Let's check. Where is it? Q. That is electric slide, which pretty much helps you glide across the map. Gives you high mobility, followed by, if you do reactivate the ability, you're able to knock up enemies. And that is pretty sick. Right now we're holding point D down, because the enemy team is trying to actually push this point. And we do have a young Drake here, so once we actually have another point, we could upgrade it, or the person that put the Drake there could upgrade it. So now it's 60-40 on power. Obviously you need 100 power in order to get the Guardian to actually fight. Oh, why did we do that? Well, actually, I think we pressed the button twice. Or we're lagging, one or the other. I don't know who cool was going here, but I'll take this. There we go. Easy kill on the snipe. I think she just gave up. Oh, no, 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 no. What? No way. Come on. Knock you up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Easy kill. Easy kill. Let's keep it going. We need stamina. We need stamina. Wait, wait, wait. Wait up. Oh, we got the bleed effect. We got the bleed effect on throwing dagger on that character. The enemy team is in lead, and obviously now we have to defend. So I'm hoping they won't be able to push. Let's get a healing... Can we get it? Can we get it? There we go. Easy. Okay, now we're just going to stand here and let it actually spawn quicker. Because due to the fact that how many plays in this actual area around the creature, the creature itself will spawn quicker. There we go. We got the young bloomer, which will help us and heal us when we need it to. Let's get the kill. The good work team. Enemy troops here. Knock her up. There we go. Let's go invisible. There's a lot of features in this character's kit that's amazing. Come on. Keep going, keep going. Yes, easy kill. Killing spree, killing spree, mates. This map is so good for trip. It's unbelievable. Oh, we missed the knock up. We got the bleed on it. Oh, wow. He jumped. Oh, he used his ability. He has an ability, T to the Swift, which can make him jump those high ledges like that. Okay, we got another two points to use in our skill point system. So let's use it. Let's try to get. That's interesting. Speed boost after each kill. Yes, please. We'll take him that. Oh my god, guys. This is going to be bloody amazing. Win the lead with actual power, so that's great for us. We need to get away from here. There we go. Thank you for the armor boost. Enemy trip is here as well. Where'd she go? She went invisible. Okay. We're just going to wait for her. She doesn't reveal herself anytime soon. Sniper's there and she's getting healed, so we can't really fight that. We have one focus point to use. We can use it to upgrade this, which I might do so. There we go. Let's get the big-ass bloomer, aka summer bloomer. Spawning and this guy will be able to heal multiple allies at once with 85 HP regen and that's amazing We're in the lead with actual power 10 more points aka one more kill 
and we'll be able to get what we want. The attack on the Guardian. Oh my god, mates. I feel like I'm a bit laggy. Maybe this is another NA server, because I don't think there's any OC servers in this game. But it doesn't matter. I'm so happy I unlocked this hero, because she's the first hero that I ever gravitated to into this game. I wanted to play it, but back then I didn't have enough coins, and obviously we had to put the grind in in order to receive those coins. And we did so, and now we're able to play this amazing character. We just reached level 5, so we've got another skill point to use. But let's try to kill this actual hero right now. I can't see her. She's down there. Oh, is that someone else, though? Oh, what? Are you serious right now? That's unfair. How did I miss that ability? It looked like I actually landed it. The knock-up from an electric slide. We have to find him. There we go. Okay, we need to get out. We need to get out. We're too low on our HP. Oh my god. The gun is back up as well. Oh no, we're attacking now. Let's go, let's go. Yes, mates. Keep going, keep going. Easy, mates. Easy. Okay, we need to go before we end up dying. Regenerate, regenerate. Come on, mates. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. Easy, easy. Get out, get it, get out. We wounded the enemy guardian. Now we have to leave before they end up killing us. Let's go back to our bloomer and he will give us HP. Let's use our skill point before we end up forgetting to use it. More movement speed ability. Yes, amazing. Oh, we got our skill specialization as well. Cunning edge. Sounds interesting. You get armor pen out of it, I think. So that's pretty sick. I think it's armor pen. Pretty sure it was armor pen. Can't, can I check anymore? I can't actually check. Okay. Either way, it's going to help us. Whenever there's a clash, and then whenever it occurs, we get bonus effects. That's the idea of the skill specialization. Can we go for this kill? Come on, come on. Go invisible, go invisible. Get out of there, get out of there, yes. I think they're upgrading a creature as well. The enemy team. Man, it sucks when you can't hold point D. You need that point. It helps out so much. Because you're able to generate more power for the objective. Oh my god, flash step as the next point. Yes, take that. Pretty much it gives you a jump before actually going invisible. So you teleport, then go invisible. I like that idea. Let's try to help out this character right here. Does that guy have Paragon within his name? Oh my god. Imagine if he was motivated to play this game because of me. That would be insane. Because I know some of you mates were actually motivated to play the game because of me. Full, res full respect over that. Oh, what? We can't actually go there. What? I thought we can leap there with the teleport ability. Maybe I should have jumped and teleported at the same time. Okay, we need to leave. That little lag back. Rubber band effect. Let's kill this enemy trip here. She went invisible. Where'd he go? She's somewhere there. She was so close. Oh my god, two of my members just died. And now we have to defend as well. Let's kill the sniper. If we can. And Tito the Swift. What? What happened just then? There we go, there we go. There we go, oh my god. I tried to activate my ability, it wouldn't activate. We're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead. Go, 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 go. Oh my god, I think there was a bleed effect on us. Yes, it was. Oh my god, the plasma blades killed us. I feel like the enemy hero is too far from us. Our guardian did get wounded. It's 2 2 right now. It's going to get insane very soon. We're level 7. Let's use another point on our. Uh, let's use a point on our throwing daggers, or plasma blades in this case. We want to call them. Extra damage if you do do it twice. Oh my god. Okay. But you have to do it in 5 seconds towards the same target. I think that's possible. That doesn't sound ridiculous at all. In a lag, and I'm Aussie, so it's gonna be super easy to land those actual blades from a range. I have to be up close and personal in order to do so, but hey, we're gonna make this happen. Tito the Swift, he just missed his fang. Here we need to get out, we need to get out. Go invisible. Let's get this HP. There we go. He knows I'm behind him. There we go, easy kill. Nice 1v1. We need to watch out from these two heroes right here. Oh, get out, get out. Oh my god, I couldn't move for some reason. I feel like I got stuck. I pressed um, the shit button twice to try and sprint out of there. But I couldn't escape. Dang, that sucks, man. We got 6 kills, 2 deaths, and 1 assist. And we summoned 2 creatures with 4.5 efficiency. 
We can kill Yeezy. Unless you escape. But you're not going to escape. Easy kill. Power play, mates. Now we're able to attack. Okay, we need to go invisible. We need to get HP before we actually go fight that. We've got 20 seconds to get to the point and fight the enemy Guardian and hopefully wound it. And I think after we wound the Guardian, it will start the clash when the map gets smaller and the creatures move to different places. I think that's the idea. Let's regenerate. We don't really have focus, so it's going to be kind of hard. Oh my god, go invisible, go invisible. Oh my god, that sucks. Can a team do it? I don't think they're going to be able to do it. No, no, get out, leave, 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 mate, leave. You're going to die as well. Oh, that sucks. That was such a hard actual fight. I think what we should have done was not straight go to the actual Guardian and destroy it. We should have killed some of the enemy players before doing so. But everyone was so hyped to go in there and just destroy the Guardian that we just got eliminated so quickly. Okay, let's move on to the next part of our throwing daggers, aka plasma blades. Adds a slow to my ability. Yes, please. So once we actually chunk a blade, it will slow them down as well. And the ultimate is interesting because you actually teleport towards the target and they do a crazy amount of damage. And I think it crits as well. So that's pretty cool. So hopefully we explained all of her abilities and someone would aware. There we go, there we go. Easy, easy. That combo was so nice. Can we kill this character? I feel like we can. We just lagged out there a minute. It's all cool. Will she have enough stamina to run away from us? Hmm. I don't think so. I feel like I'm lagging because I jump out of certain points. You're dead. Easy kill. She's a beast in 1v1s, I'll be honest. You're dead. Oh my god, mate. Oh, that was insane. Can we get this other kill? Need some power. Oh, what? What's shooting us? She's up there. I couldn't see her. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Go invisible. No, we can't go invisible. We've got eight seconds. The thing about this character, the visibility, the cool then once you activate it, and if you get out of the actual stealth or visibility, it takes around 20 seconds to come back. I think that's the idea. Um, what can we put into... This one's pretty sick. Massive shock over th um, three seconds. That's 300 damage. Let's do that. See if it works out. We're defending at this current moment. We do have quite a bit of shield. Let's land this. Keep going, keep going. Good work, good work. Who's the other character? There's one here, there's one here. She can't leave. There's no way she's gonna leave. Oh, we missed our bleed. Should we invisible? I think I found her though. We need to go invisible. Let's get out of here. Or oh, we could fight her. Oh my god, guys. Did you just see that? That was insane. I went full focus mode just then. Because I was so terrified. If we would end up dying in that 1v1. Because it was so low in HP. Oh, it's Clash. Clash has begun, I think. There you go. That's the Clash event. I always say when the Guardians attack, that's the Clash event. But either way. So what happens now, everything goes smaller. Guardians move a bit. And it gets more interesting because once the map is smaller, we have a larger impact on the map. And it's going to be bloody amazing. It's going to be a swell time. That is guaranteed. They have a young blue man there, so I can't really fight that. Because of the HP region that character will be getting. But I feel like I can burst it down. We don't have an ultimate, though. So we're going to try, though. Where should go? Should we invisible? Oh, we missed it. Oh, my God. We got this. We got this. Easy, easy, easy. Oh, my God. Rampage, mates. Insane. She's like the perfect hero on this map. When she was on free rotation, I did try and make a commentary then. And I played on a different map and it wasn't great at all. It just made it so hard for her to succeed. Trip is here as well. Where is she? She's down there. She's down. You're dead. Easy, mate. Oh my god. We've got level 10. That means we're able to put our last point into our skill tree. Ooh. We did that one right there. She was sniping me from that far. Okay. 
Let's go here and let's get some HP from our actual creature. I think it's point C. No, 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 it's point A. There we go, enough HP. Let's go and try to fight. Did she go invisible? She went invisible. There she is. Oh my god. Oh my god. We were wrecking them. We need 10 more points. Oh, we have to destroy this creature before it gets the power. I think once we... Oh, are you serious? They gained 20... Oh, they got double kills just then. That sucks. That's the power play for them. And now we need to go... Wait. Easy, easy, easy. What? He didn't teleport. That was insane. I don't know why. I think there's a range to the ability. Once they reach a certain distance away, it doesn't work. I'll put the creature there just to stall them. I don't know if we can actually fight. Because they're not pushing. They're trying to control this point. Why can't I use my ability? I can't use my ultimate. There we go. What? She didn't die. You gotta be insane. Get out, get out, get out quick. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Someone's chasing us. I think it's Tito the Swift. I'm not exactly sure. Let's go to our bloomer and let's get our HP back. And let's even enter the invisibility because... I don't want to die. Teacher the Swift was down there. So he was close to us. I think he was trying to go for us. Okay, we're 20 points in the lead. Now that it's 50-50 on power. Come on, mates. We need this. Kill the healer. Slow her down. Keep chasing her. Massive shock. Think about this. We got this. Easy work. Easy work. Okay, 60-60. Oh, they're going to get it again. We need to kill one of them. At least kill this creature. We win. You got the next attack point on the guy. Don't fight. Don't fight. Don't die. Don't. If he dies. Oh my god. He died. One job. One job, mate. Just don't die. That was all that was needed. We killed the creature. We got 10 points that we needed in order to reach our 100 points destination. But hey, what can you do? Not enough time anymore. We kill the sniper. There we go. Let's go back because enemy trip is here trying to kill us. Get some HP and let's fight. Put the slow on them. Yes. Nice work. Nice work. Keep killing them. Don't let them get close to us. And our guardian. Shall we get this kill? Come on, come on. No way she's healing for that much. We missed the bleed. Tito the Swift is behind us. We couldn't jump up there with our electric slide. That sucks. Kill the Cyclops. There we go. Good work, team. Good work. Now we're doing something. Okay, it's pretty even this game. It's a one hard game, actually. And it's very interesting because once they're harder, it makes it more fun. Won 18 kills! Three deaths! Oh my god, mates. I think I'm going to be a trip main after this. <laughs> this is insane. Oh, so much hype. Especially because I've been playing Paragon for such a long time. I have a video most likely uploading at this current moment of Paragon. And I wanted to play this game instead. Just for a bit. Just to break the ice. Because this game is enjoyable as well. Like, I love all the games that I try to introduce to the channel for you mates to enjoy. Some of them get better feedback, some of them don't, but obviously I'm going to keep introducing new games to the channel no matter what. Because I feel like it's the right thing to do. Okay, we need to back off. Where's Tito the Swift? The enemy one. Okay, we need to be careful. We need 20 more points. We can get that point C. Just don't die. Don't die. Oh, we, we can get this kill. Can we get this? Ulti, ulti, ulti. There we go. Made the power play. And we got unstoppable. Oh my god. This is great for us. We can actually um, wound the enemy guardian. Where'd he go? She's behind you. She's behind you. Missed attacker. No, 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 no. There we go. 
We saved his life. OP, OP. <laughs> let's get some stamina and let's run back into the enemy guardian and try and wound them. Oh, looks like we already wounded them. We had two members ready down there, so that's great for us. And they did destroy our actual creature up here. Yeah, that's no fun there, man. That's no fun. When you go to a place like that and there's arms everywhere and it does 150 damage per second. Oh my god, mates. I don't want to be there any longer. <laughs> this is such a fun experience. Can we do anything? I don't think we can there. <gasps> Free kill. Free kill. Are we lagging? Oh my god, no. Please. Don't say this has happened. Don't say my connection DC'd. I bet our connection DC'd. This is not happening. Oh my god. Can we reconnect at least? Like, if I was... Connection lost. Okay. We can see if we can reconnect. If that's possible. We'll be back in a couple of minutes, most likely. My internet always DCs like this, and I'm hoping we can come back to it. Because I'm missing this already. The insane moments that we've had in this one gameplay. Crazy. Oh yes, mates. We can actually connect back. Wait. Error. What? I have no clue what's happening right now. But I'm hoping we can join back into the game. That was such a fun game, and I don't want my team to lose. See if we can get back into it. Yes, I think we can. Oh my god. Is it loading? What's this? What is going on? I have no clue what just happened. I don't know if this is a feature. I think once you reconnect, um, it takes you a couple seconds to spawn back. I think that's the idea. Or oh, we just died. I think we just died. We have four deaths. Hmm. Looks like our guardian got wounded as well, and also the enemy team, which we already know of. It's 1-1. It's pretty close right now. I'm hoping I can save the team and we can win this game. Because right now, the enemy team is in the lead, and I don't want to lose because we've done so much in this one gameplay. Let's fight, let's fight. Come on, come on. Massive shock. Let's do some damage. Go invisible. Oh, we fell in invisibility. What? I couldn't get out in time. Oh my god, this is such bad luck. No way, man. From the one disconnect, it, it cost us so much. Oh my god, this sucks. Don't die, don't die, Tito the Swift. Save yourself. We need some players defending at least. Because three of us are dead, and that's not a good sign. We spawn in nine seconds, and we have to defend in five seconds. You can see the problem right there. Oh my god. All the enemy players are close to the Guardian. This doesn't look great, mates. Come on, kill them, kill them. Get the shield stack. Get the shield stack. You can do it, mates. Come on. Oh, yes. One kill you got. Let's get down there. Let's get down there. There we go. Oh, Tito the Swift left. No, he's not leaving. He's not leaving. Come on. We're going to chase him down. I want to kill this guy for what he's done. Oh, he went to the other side. Oh, my God. We went to the other creature. There we go. Kill the enemy trip. We're on 20 kills right now. This is bloody amazing. We need to win this for our team. We can't lose. Massive shock. There we go. Do damage. Come on, come on. We can do this. We can kill them. I'm confident about this. I'm not confident anymore. We need to leave, we need to leave. The enemy is a creature destroyed before it We're in the lead right now. I swear we can make a massive play out of this. Just a couple more kills and get some power from our creatures. And we should be able to win. Why does all the creatures next to me appear red when they're friendly? Oh, some bugs. It doesn't matter though. Every game in beta does have bugs and you can see them right now. Oh, we missed the massive shock. Oh my god. Missed the slow as well. Come on, come on, we got this. Ulti, ulti. There we go. Good work, good work. We need to leave this. Can't actually win that trade. We need 20 more points. Let's just slide out of there. TJ the Swift is here. Heal me, Bloomer. Heal me, heal me. Oh my god. Yes, we got the um, time to attack now. But why isn't it healing me? There we go, there we go. Okay. We got this, mates. Oh my god, I think we can win. We can win. 
Good work. Hey, what's the win button? I don't know what the win button is. No! No! That's bad! That's so bad. I don't know if we can win. Come on. Oh, this is bad. This isn't a great sight. Ah, this hurts. The fire Drake wrecked me. Like, I know Trip did some damage, but what just came out of there? How do I die? It was from Trip. But the Drake did 500 damage. With that one attack, that one burning effect attack. Oh my god. Come on, someone, Bloomer. Save him. Save him. Jump away, Tito the Swift. No. They have 20 points already. They're in the lead, followed by... Um, the point G and also our point A. We're going to get 20. They're going to get 40. We need two kills at least. Or even three kills to get in the lead. Hoping we can actually have another chance to win the enemy guardian and win this game. This has been one intense game. Oh my god, man. Kill the arms. We don't want these arms here. Massive shock. There we go. With that electric side. Oh my god, we can kill this. We missed the, the actual slow effect. That sucks. There we go. There we go. Easy kill. Regenerate. Regenerate. Let's help our friend here. If they do get chased, but I don't think we're going to get chased. We shall see, though. No? The enemy team is in the lead. Oh, my God. This doesn't look great, mates. Honestly, this does not look great. The enemy team is going to start pushing up. Tito the Swift is here. He's trying to attack this arm that we do have here. Are they going to be... Can they snipe from down there? No, they can't. Oh my god, they can snipe ice though. What? How did it lose health so quickly? Oh my god. I knew I knew he had low health, but like, not that much. Oh, that's so unfair. Fewest deaths we got as a title. We just got most kills as well. We got past 19 kills. Come on, mates. What is this? Oh, my God. That was one intense game. But, mates, in the comment section down below, I want to know your thoughts about this game, how we played, and that unfortunate event that we did have, which was a DC, followed up by no connection to the actual servers, and then when we once got in there, we lost. But, hey, what do you think about the hero? I want to know your thoughts about that, because I personally think it's bloody amazing. Tell me your thoughts and your opinions in the comment section down below. So, mates, if you did enjoy this video, show your support smash that like button. Let's try to get 100 likes on this video. And if you mentioned want to see more gigantic gameplay or gaming content on my channel, all you have to do is share this with your friends and hit the subscribe button to become a mate today. And that's all for this video. I'll be time to go, but don't worry. We'll be back very soon. Hey, Dad's boys, you guys ain't nothing yet. Trip is such an amazing hero. One hero that I'm going to main guaranteed. <laughs> and then it feels right.